Hey, what's up everybody? So today I'm gonna be showing you my Ellie shipment, uh, which is workout clothing. This is what it looks like. Um, I think last month they sent it in like a box. Um, and I think that's because they had a free gift. But this month they sent it in a bag. So quick story time. Um, I actually didn't realize I signed up for a subscription um, and I had canceled a lot of subscriptions that were reoccurring through my PayPal and for some reason I didn't see it on there um, and it just didn't seem like super clear um, when I bought the first uh, set that I got uh, which was discounted. So this uh, package here includes a top, a workout, joggers, bra, and then like some pants. Um, so it ended up being $48, which, you know, isn't bad. I mean, their, their clothing is pretty high quality, so I don't have any complaints with that at all. Um, my complaint is their customer service. Um, with my last shipment, I wanted to exchange um, the jog bra for a larger size. It felt really tight for a medium, so I had emailed them and then I just, I never got a response. And then I verified on their uh, return policy. It looks like that you have to return your whole set if you want to exchange, which is, I don't know, kind of weird because I just wanted to exchange the, the top for a bigger size. Um, so it was like, it was within their policy. Like they, they say they accept, accept returns or exchanges. Um, I just, they never responded. Um, and so when I saw that they had charged me for an another shipment, that's kind of when I had an issue. Um, and I think I ended up disputing it, also saying that they never responded to me in regard to exchanging my prior items. So therefore like, I don't really want to do business with them if I can't actually get a response from someone. And I believe this was like back in like late December, early January or something like that and no one ever responded. Um, so I was kind of I was kind of upset like okay you're renewing my subscription and it's probably not going to be the correct size or fit me. Um, and so I sent them another email saying you guys never got back to me on my you know asking if I could return or exchange for another size and you know you went and charged me for another subscription can you please cancel this because at this point, I don't even know if it's going to fit me. They never got back to me. Um, and then I also disputed it through PayPal, which was denied twice. Um, even though I showed the screen cap saying like the seller was not responsive. And so they respond to PayPal, my case through PayPal. But to this day, and we're almost mid-February, they had never responded to my first email. They never responded to my second email um, asking for, you know, to to cancel um, because you know $50 a month is kind of a lot I mean their clothing is the quality is nice the clothing is nice but it's not really something that I'd want to get every single month um, and no email they would they never responded to either of those emails but they respond to PayPal that's my biggest beef with the service is that the customer service is non-existent so if you are considering the subscription I would just um, kind of proceed with caution um, and they do accept returns and exchanges I believe they return they do accept returns and exchanges so I could actually return this shipment for a refund theoretically but honestly I don't even know if I want to bother um, because you know my PayPal case was a nine, I was charged to forty-eight dollars, but I don't know if I want to return it because nobody responds. So I'm afraid that if I send this back without getting any sort of confirmation from anyone there, that um, I'm just gonna lose money. <laughs> so I'm, I'm just hesitant to return something to a place where I can't get any sort of response. So I'll probably just end up keeping it and just eating the the money that I lost. Um, but it is kind of disappointing because I did like the clothing. It's just the customer service like really needs some improvement. Um, like why don't you respond to your customers but you respond to PayPal? I mean, anyway, let's go ahead and get into the bag. Uh, this will be my last one for now. I mean, I again, I do like the clothing and I would be tempted to try them out in the future, but 
the lack of any sort of customer service just kind of put a sour taste in my mouth like you know the returns should be easy they say that oh you know returns are easy that they accept them but nobody it says to oh yeah email this email address and someone will assist you with your return or exchange no one ever responds so <laughs> just fyi if you're looking to try them out all right so here's the bag all right so i didn't get to pick anything in here so hopefully i like it it looks so far like everything's nice okay so they include this little packing slip it's just like a little it looks like just a cover i thought it was a card but it's just like a little cover and this is the billing uh it looks like okay so i get large bottoms and two medium tops which hopefully they fit um so we'll see let's try that out and then here are the pants. I do like the color. I don't really have any of this dark purple color. Um, it's kind of violet, violet-ish, like a dark violet maroon color. It's really nice. The quality is nice. I feel like I've seen this brand on Amazon though. Um, so it's by Marika and the size large. So this is what they look like. They look small for a large. I'm just gonna say that off the bat they look like something like it's like that's in a medium on amazon so hopefully they fit i do like the nice phone pocket that's always nice so these are nice okay it's not huge they kind of curve in a little bit so i will try them on for you guys but this is what this is what it looks like they're long and it looks like maybe it looks like they're like um uh just like above the ankle so we got the pants and then it looks like they sent a jacket And this is a medium. Um, it looks a little bit on the smaller side. I wish it was a full zip. It looks like it's like a half a zip. But this is what it looks like. So, okay, here we go. That's what this one looks like. It's like a, like a dusty uh, rose pink color. This actually goes nice with the, the leggings. And it has like this tie at the bottom here. So if you want to tighten it, it has it's kind of that style. So it's cute. I just wish it was like a full zip, but it is really cute. So there is that. And then, oh, it looks like there's no jog bra. It looks like it's just a tank, the sweater, and the pants, which this would be good for like hiking during like the cooler months but we're getting into february it does seem like it's like a little little it's getting warmer like it's good so i don't know how much i'm really gonna get use of that until like next winter um because i am here in california and it's been like 70 ish degrees although that actually might be good for like um like hiking around the mountains in san francisco because it does get cool cool there so that might be uh, worthwhile. Okay, so here's the tank. This is cute. I do like this. I do think this will, this one will fit. So no jog bra. This is just a jacket, tank top, and uh, active wear pants. So I do like the colors. Um, I mostly have greens and blacks. So I do like kind of the more pinkish purple colors. This is a nice set. Um, so as I said, it is worth keeping just because like you know you can't get a hold of anybody um and i'm afraid to return it without you know not hearing from anyone and I, yeah because you're supposed to message them and no one responds so this is what it looks like it's really cute um i do like the oversized tank look and this is something i'd wear at, like at home too so there is the three-piece set. I do like it, so I'm just going to keep it and just 
whatever I don't know maybe I'll subscribe in the future if I have a good enough discount and then remember to cancel but it's just not being able to get a hold of someone is just not <laughs> not a very good business model all right so the next thing I have for you guys is let's see okay all right so i'm gonna wrap up this video um and then i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys beachly so thank you guys so much for watching if you decide to subscribe to this company i'll link down below but just proceed with caution because your customer service kind of sucks hey guys so i'm back and i'm going to show you a new subscription that i got and this is by beachly um and it seems right up my alley i'm totally a beach gal i just, i miss hawaii so much that i've been dreaming about it and my husband and i have been talking about um, in the future whenever you know we decide to um, get a investment property maybe getting one in um, hawaii uh, because that is something that we have been wanting to do uh, sometime down the line so i'm just really excited about that um, so I got some Beachly and this is like for anyone whether you live near the beach or not if you are just a big beach bum <laughs> like I am they have all kinds of beach goodies they have cosmetics they have uh, clothing um, facial products and um, so this is a an, uh, quarterly subscription and I believe it's a hundred dollars or ninety nine dollars quarterly which I think is worth it because you don't end up with all the clutter and it's only like four times a year versus monthly so i am excited about it and i signed up with a bonus box code so they i noticed there's only one box so i don't know if they just put everything together in one but i'm supposed to get like two for the price of one being a first time subscriber so we're gonna go ahead and see what is in that box um so it'll be cool. Um, I'm really excited for it. I have no idea what's in it. It seemed to take a little bit. Um, I was looking at the reviews saying that some people ordered around Christmas time and the things weren't coming in time. So I think I ordered this around January 22nd and we're like February 10th. So like three weeks or so. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and dive into that. So this is what it looks like here. And it says, warning good vibes may be contagious i love the packaging this is what looks like right here the top this is beachly so all right so let's go ahead and get into this one do, 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 do. okay easy to open Here's the peak of the inside. They also have a little questionnaire about your sizing and preferences, um, similar to like other, not because it's not really a clothing subscription because it has a mix of beauty and just practical items and clothing wear. Um, but I am really excited about it. Everything's supposed to be really good quality. So they do ask that. So the first thing I got here was this pair of slippers. I love the tropical print. I just love tropical print in general. I don't know if you've noticed, but I wear it quite a lot. And this is just super cute for, honestly, it reminds me of like going to the spa where they have you put on those little slippers, you know, with the robe. Um, so it's really kind of nice. Um, you can wear it like around the house or if you are gonna give yourself the spa night. Um, so there's those. And then the next one we have here is this cute little uh, like beach vibe tropical pillow. This is really cute. I like this a lot. It has like this ombre kind of striped effect. So that is really cute. And then has like a little card. Okay. So this is the card that they sent. Uh, so this is by a company, I think, that designed that pillow. You can kind of see it in this picture right here. 
sewing down south. That's really cool. Okay. And then we have the winter booklet for winter 2021. And here, okay, so it shows the pricing of the items or the retail price. And you can also shop their store if you don't want a subscription. Um, so this, um, so the sandals have a retail price of $49. Um, so let's see, so this is by Island House Co. Uh, designed or started as a creative haven to design coastal prints. So some, this is actually similar to like kind of the women's collective box or fad fit fun where you kind of have like some artisans uh, curating a lot of the stuff, which is really cool. Um, and then the pillow was also retailed at 49, which I don't think I would pay that normally, but you know, it's in this box. So I'm super happy with it um, by sewing down south. So the palm print offers a pop of color and West Coast vibes while sea urchin design showcases the classic East Coast nautical style. And I wonder if they knew that I was on the West Coast, so they sent me the West Coast one. So these are two different variations you could have received. I received this one right here, which is um, actually my favorite. I prefer it. I just love the print. Um, so that's really cool. Alrighty. So... Okay, so the next one we have here is the Sunray Beanie, retailed at 25, which actually is not too bad. Um, and this is by Virginia Wolf. It's a seasonal staple uh, updated with a rich gold color, a vibrant sun patch, and a removable strap-on palm. So I guess this palm is removable. That's pretty cool. So if you know you don't really want that, and you just kind of want something like less wintry, you can just take it off. So. Okay, that is really cool. And then, so so far it's looking like they only sent me one box. So I'm gonna have to message them and ask when the other box is coming because you would think that they would come at the same time. So I'm gonna have to email them. Um, so this is the hydrating body lotion that retails at $38. This is by Pirate. Um, it is lightweight, fast absorbing, and rich with antioxidants, composed of coconut oil, macadamia oil, shea butter, infused with Pirette flagship scent. Ooh, I've never heard of that. Apply to skin after shower at night before getting dressed or when your skin is feeling dry. Oh, it smells really nice. Oh, wow. It's, oh, it's just the, the quality on that. It just smells so good. Oh, wow. It just, it smells moisturizing. Oh, that is so good. Yeah, filled with an, uh, infused with an authentic beach scent, which is the vibes that I got smelling this. Yeah, I've smelled something similar before and I, I like this a lot. So that'll get some use. Um, okay. So let's see. The next one we have is the Coconut Sands Shell Candle by Tiny Bandit. And oh, FYI, the lotion retails at 38, which is a lot for lotion, but it smells like legit spa lotion. Um, so we have the Tiny Bandit candle here, which is really cute. This retails for $20. Um, the cozy yet coastal candle fe features hand poured coconut wax, a cotton wick, and tropical notes that will transport you to a surf line beach. It is lightly sprinkled with crystals and shells from the sea. Welcome to your dream paradise. Okay. Ooh, that's really cool. Yeah, you can see the um, the shells and the crystals. That looks really nice. Ooh, and I love like these, I got a candle like this. I don't, I think it was in the women's collective box. Um, that was really nice. Like these cute little travel uh, candle tins. These are always really nice, you know. You love candles, which I know so many people who do. And just, you know, you can pack it away and take something with you. And yeah, so that's really cool. And so I think we're down to the last item, which is the Twin Palms cardigan that retails at $119. Um, let's see, this is by The Beach People, which is a, these are all Beachly exclusives. No, or only a few, oh, 
Everything except the lotion was a Beachley exclusive, it looks like. Uh, that's really cool. So I guess they like did a collab. Um, so this Cool Weather Companion is made with a premium bl brand blend of plush acrylic fabrics. Okay, so that's really awesome. All right, so let's try it on. So this is a medium large. Okay. I think they ask you for your sizing when you sign up. This is, wow, this is quite big. Okay, this is, the, this is the back. Cute little palm trees. Okay, so this is by the beach people. Ooh, this is nice. So it's like an oversized. So if you guys are able to see that, okay. It's really cute. Definitely something you can wear, like on a spa type day vibe. Okay, everything's falling. <laughs> okay, so this is really nice. So this is what it looks like. Has uh, little little pockets. You guys can see that palm trees on the back. So this is a nice cardigan. I really like it. It is a little bit like more oversized, so you can just, you know, if it's chilly on the beach, like it often is here, you know, the closest beach that we have is, I think, around like San Francisco, Santa Cruz, where it does kind of get chilly. So this is kind of nice to kind of take with you and just kind of have those cozy beach vibes. Um, but yeah, so that brings me to the end of, um, okay, the... Beachly box. I was supposed to receive another one for signing up, so I'm gonna have to email them because that's a little strange. Like, what's my other box? Because they should have come together. <laughs> All right, um, well, let me know down below what you guys think of this subscription. I think this is a keeper. I definitely would use pretty much everything in this box. Um, and it's just more my style. It's not like specifically one thing. So you can get different things each month. You can get some skincare lotion and oh it's so worth it and it only comes every three months um and i think there's spring co collections coming up i think march or something march or april so i'm excited but i'm hopefully hoping i can get that bonus box so that way i can show you guys what i got in there um because i do want to buy some things on their shop but the bonus box is supposed to be like a collective of items from past boxes um so i don't want to buy something and then find out i got it in the box later you know um so yeah i will keep you guys updated on that when i receive it soon um but thank you guys so much for watching let me know if you would try the subscription box down below um and please don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed it i would super appreciate it and yeah i'll see you guys next time bye